Hawkins, thanks very much indeed. Uh, we're going to be live in the House of uh, Commons uh, shortly. Uh, now I think we're going to take you to the weather forecast. Yeah, we are. <sighs> I thought it was all going to go spiralling out of control. They go hideously wrong. Weather, weather it was throws off YouTube... so, so... It was going to be a YouTube moment. A YouTube classic. Was... Yeah. It's not easy. He makes it look easy, but really throwing to the weather, to Nick, it's... Finished. Years of experience. You finished. Oh, come on, there'll be no time for it soon. <laughs> oh, Nick, hi. Oh, Nick, sorry, I didn't realise you were listening. <laughs> yeah. All right, we've got rain across much of the UK this afternoon. It's clearing away eastwards, drier weather following on behind, but there are showers to the northwest. And what we'll notice. Very good afternoon. You are watching BBC News with um, Emily Maitlis and John Sopel. It's exactly. It's exactly 3.31, actually. Uh, and we'll bring you our top stories. We're going to take you to the Commons as soon as Chris Bryant is on his feet. We're expecting a question from him, followed by a statement from the Chancellor. Uh, first, though, the headlines this afternoon. Countries across the world have been <laughs> reacting. What are you looking at? Just, just mildly laughing. I'm just <laughs> waiting to see what's going to happen next. Right, let's start again. Countries have been <laughs> reacting with some alarm. Well, in the... T Go on, you do it. She was eating a chocolate, OK? That's the truth of it. Right, I will, I will read this. We're going to start again. Countries across the world have been reacting, some with alarm, following the death of the North Korean leader Kim Jong-il. China has pledged support to the secretive nation, whilst Japanese ministers have held emergency security meetings. Officials were told to prepare for the unexpected. Here, the Foreign Secretary has suggested North Korea use the change as a turning point to develop international relations. 